precious child in the world. Come stand before your Father in heaven this day. Take a step towards me, my child. Walk into my loving embrace. I am here for you. I love you. I know you. I created you. I thought you into being, my child. There was a time in your history when I thought you into being. When I thought only about you. About your existence. The plans and purposes for your life the desires in your heart. There was a time when I thought only of you. And now you are here on the earth amongst millions and millions of people. Yet I know you so well, my child. I knitted you together in your mother's womb. You are fearfully and wonderfully made. I see you, I know you well, you are my child and I am your father in heaven and I will love you eternally. Nothing can separate you from my love my child, you are beautiful in my sight. Do not think that I am angry with you this day. All I desire is your heart. All I desire is that you know me well. That you believe in my son. That you receive him as your Lord and Saviour. Because he is my son. And he loves you. Invite the Holy Spirit into your life this day the Spirit of God and allow me to speak with you one on one just as I am speaking with this maid servant this day. I want for you to know me well my child before life's end. I want for you to dance with me in paradise. I want to give you good things. I want to set you free, set your heart ablaze. I want for you to stand before me in spirit and in truth, giving your whole heart and soul unto me, surrendering all so that I can take up all the things, all the burdens in your life and carry them for you. I understand how hard this world is at times, how emotionally hard it is, financially hard, mentally hard, physically hard. I understand the spiritual battle that wages war against your soul. But my child, we came, we came with a plan for your soul, for your sin, for your salvation, to forgive you, to offer you forgiveness in Jesus' name. And we ask that you forgive others in return. We love you, my child, and that is why we came. That is why we are speaking with you now. Through these words, through my Holy Bible, through my Holy Spirit, I am inviting you to come. Stand before me this day, my child. Come into my heavenly realms. Come worship in spirit and truth. Come dance in glory. There is nothing for you to lose, but everything for you to gain. Because I promise to pour my peace, the peace of God which transcends all understanding, into your heart, mind and soul this hour. I come. To bless you and to heal you and to deliver you 
and to set you free. Precious child in the world, I want only good things for your life. I let your hora hoshiki, all the dreams I placed in your heart, I wish to come to fruition in your lifetime. But you must place your hand in mine and I promise to walk with you daily. I promise to lead and guide you into your future, my child, into eternal life. I promise to be there for you, to never leave you or forsake you. I am there for you, my child. I have been there with you since the very beginning. You are beautiful. You are my child. And I love you. I love you eternally. Come to me this day, my child. Bow your knee before me. Raise your hands and allow me to impart peace upon your life. Feel my Holy Spirit within you now. Feel my love, my joy, my delight in you this day, my child. Know that you are loved unconditionally because I created you. I want you to be on the earth right now. I know the plans I have for you, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you a hope and a future. I am your future, my children. I am your eternal life. Jesus Christ is the way. He is the truth and he is the life. Put your trust in him this day. Put your hope in him. We will not forsake you. We will not let you down. You can trust us, my child, because we are not like man. Our thoughts are higher than your thoughts. Our ways are higher than your ways. There is nothing we cannot do for you, my child, this day. No prayer we cannot answer. No situation we cannot bring you through. No trial or struggle or burden we cannot deliver you from. Blessed child, come to us this day. Reach out your hand and place it in mine. And together we will fly. In Jesus' name, Amen. Precious children in the world, those who have surrendered their whole heart and soul unto me, those who have given unto me their whole life, those who believe in my Holy Son, thank you. Thank you for your devotion. Thank you for your praise. I am with you. In spirit and in truth as you were with me. Come my children, fly, fly into paradise this day. Let see the golden glory before you. Lord of Atharasi, I see Mahashem Kirasi, myself in heaven, in paradise. I see my guardian angel, Karahashikiti, the one who looks after me, Karahashikiti, Karahashikiti, Kehoprabasi, on the earth. Alehe Kerehashi, he is standing with me. Alehe Rahashikite, Rabashikite, I love your angels, my Lord. They are so beautiful. They love you. Oh, Alehe Rehashi, how much they love you. I pray, my Lord, that I can love you as much as they do. They only have eyes for you. They are so pure, so beautiful, without sin. They glow with the light of heaven. They are almost translucent in my sight this day. They are so filled with your love. As I hold my angel's hand, I feel the love of heaven pouring through me. He smiles, for he knows the journey that we are about to embark on. My child, beautiful one, I have ordained that this angel walks through heaven with you, to protect your spirit. For you still reside on the earth at this time, my child. 
Eliharabah, you can trust my angel, Kahina, he will not hurt you, he will not lead you astray. He is not of the Dikara darkness, Sahihala, he is not fallen. Kanaha Nahashiki knows you well. Mandara has a he will hold your hand, just a put your trust in all that he is. Allah Hashikit, a holy angel of your Lord God. He is not to be worshipped. Haleri Kokhara has he simply exists where I am. He has always existed where I am. He is eternal. And in he cannot die. Haleta Potora has he Hashikiti, and he watches over your life. I know, my child, that you do not like to talk about the angels. Karaha, the world has tainted my angels. Made them into something that cannot be trusted. New age of the dark side. But the truth is, my child, there are angels in heaven and my angels do take care of my children in the world, ministering spirits sent to serve those who will inherit salvation. So it is only right that you see the one who takes care of you this day. I am so thankful. Kashika is so appreciative of all this angel does for my soul. How can I thank someone who takes care of me in such an amazing way? Who loves me unconditionally? Who cares for my well-being, my soul, and leads me to safety? Thank you, Heavenly Father, for sending your Holy Spirit to live within us on the earth. Thank you for your holy angels that look after us. Thank you for your Holy Spirit, your word. Your holy word. Your holy son, our Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ. I'm so thankful to know you during my lifetime. And I pray, Karahashik, in the name of Jesus, for a great awakening of souls this day across the earth. That every knee will bow and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. To your glory, Father, for your glory. For you alone are worthy, you alone are holy. The Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Come, my child. Do not delay. Start to walk along the path before you. I take one step, begin to smile as joy overwhelms my soul. For I know I am taking one step closer into heaven, into the heavenly realms. Amahara has seen to all that is to come, so that I can report and record all which I see for mankind. I let or something to leave behind for the world, for all of God's children to see. I let her experience, feel, so that they might all believe Kahashiki Akarahasi without doubting and rejoice and be glad in each day. For there is nothing to fear, Alehera, upon the moment of death. For we will all take a step along this path at life's end. Those who believe, those who have received Jesus Christ as their Lord and Saviour. You will all walk into paradise. You will all walk along this path. The path which leads to glory. The path to paradise. And so I take a step, and another, and another, and as I do, Allah, the glory begins to fall, and my spirit begins to burn, Allah, with such love, 
I learn in your a love that cannot be described with words. The love of heaven and joy. Such joy fills my spirit at this time. I wish to skip along this path. I cannot stop smiling. It is so beautiful. I see flowers, beautiful flowers everywhere. I reach down and pick a flower. The scent of the flower overwhelms me. Oh, Hashikiti, she another fragrance. Oh, Lady Anoko, she a Hashikiti. Oh, Kohashi, what joy. Alehanaharavasi, I look around and everything is beautiful. There are no worries or concerns. There is no fear of death, condemnation, judgment, hell. Alehanaharavasi, Hashikiti. For in this place we are free. Our spirit is free. There is only lightness. Oh, Mahina Hashiki Anokoko. I keep walking along the path. My angel with me. I see a bench. And my Lord sits upon it. And I want to run towards him. He smiles at me, as if I am the only person on the earth. As if no one else exists. He smiles. And I know him. My spirit knows him. Longs for him. Wants only to be with him, my Lord, my Saviour, Jesus Christ. I run and fall at his feet. So thankful is to see him, to be with him now. I do not want to leave. I never wish to return. I wish to stay with him forever. Oh Lord Jesus, may I stay with you forever. Please do not send me back, <laughs> even though I love all of the things that are happening in the world at this time. All oh, the beauty you have shown me in my life. I laid out my family and friends. I love them all. <laughs> but to be with you completes my soul. To be with you is the fullness of joy. I need to stay at your feet forever. I want to worship you forever, every moment of every day, for eternity. Kashika for worshipping you. Kahale is the most amazing, beautiful, arahot experience. Kashika for my soul. My mind is silent as I sit before you. There is such peace. There is nothing to fear. Nothing to worry about. You have all things under your will and control. I trust you completely. Beautiful child, precious one. You have been chosen to go on a most beautiful journey with me. Of the next thousand words that your dear friend and you are now recording. You will walk into heaven each day so that I can release heaven on earth, my beauty, my glory. Through these messages, my children, these messages that you will leave behind, that you will release into the world and then walk away, not looking back, just releasing them. Trusting that those who need to hear these messages will hear them. This is your purpose. It's all I desire from you to do. My child, yes, you can sit at my feet forever.
You can Har Hash be with me here night and day. Center your thoughts on this vision. This is an eternal vision for your soul. See your angel Kahahina Bifkar Hasaid you. Alehera Hashi Kiti feel my Holy Spirit within you. Alehera Hahina Hashi Hukia see the Hahi Heavenly Father. Our Father, Heshiko Pahara Okuroho Shikitiya, all around you, my child. He is in all things. He is everything. He loves you. You never have to leave, my child. Oh, Lord, Haleri Hasikri, my God, Lord, my God. I feel so relieved to hear this. is like a great weight lifting off my shoulders to know that finally I can stay with you in spirit and in truth. And in Mokoto that you are not going to send me back. to this hardened earth. Haleri, my child, you now live in heaven on earth and you are safe. You are protected. No one can hurt you. For I have placed my angels around you both. I ordain you to preach my message unto the nations to release these words. Yes, you will be on the earth, my child, for it is not your time to physically pass. But in spirit and in truth you stay with me. No one will understand all which you are speaking now. Only the other maid servant who writes and records words such as these. This is my gift unto you both. To lift you high in spirit, away from the darkness. Akashi away from the terror. Alehi the darkness of the earth that's kinda consuming so many souls at this time. You are seated now in heavenly places. Never do you have to return. This is my gift unto you both. And you will continue to walk along this path of heaven so that you can reveal these words to the nations and many souls will be saved. Many will run towards me, many will fall at my feet. Do you understand all I am speaking with you now, my child? I know it will be so tempting to focus again on the earth, on the matters of the world. But this is not what I desire from you this day. I desire worship, my child. To be with me. Throughout every moment of your life, I desire for you to be with me. And I'm asking you this day to lay down the things of the world, the people, everything so that you can spend the hala eternal time with me can you do this my child can you do this starting today oh my lord hala i want nothing else all i desire is to be with you i'm so tired of the things of the earth the distractions and I long to lay them down to be with you. I long to be with you, my God. Amakahia, my creator. Falaharahisi, my savior. I do not care for the things of the world anymore, my Lord. So many time-wasting things. When I could be gazing upon your beauty, your radiance, your love. There is nothing I want more, my Lord. 
doesn't to be Karahash in this place of worship night and day. In every spare moment of my life I want to worship. I don't want to be doing Karahashiki trivial things on the earth. I want to worship you. Karavihana, blessed child in the world. Hashiana, divine order and all your heart's desires of Karahashiki will come into your life if you stand before me in worship. For I know your prayers, I know your heart's desires, I know what you need. And therefore I promise, if you stand before me in worship, divine order will flow into every area of your life. Because you are surrendering everything to me. You are gazing upon my glory. If you give unto me all, your whole heart and soul, my child then all things will be added unto you. You do not even have to ask, my child, because I know you will be with me and I will be with you. And anything that is in your heart, I will see and I will respond and I will give and I will bless. I want only good things for your life. Can you give me your whole heart and soul this day? Can you lay down everything from the earth so that I can lift you higher and higher each day? Yes, my Lord. I wish to surrender all things from the earth unto you this day. I do not wish to gaze upon the world any longer. I only desire to gaze upon you, your beauty your countenance. O koma heya leribo derisi kiya hashi kiya mohoro hashi kiti. You are all things to my heart, mind and soul. I never hashi kiya hashi kiti. It is my pleasure to give up all things on the earth for you. For you lived and died and rose again for me. Halehera for my sin. Hadeha for karafu. For the forgiveness of my soul and eternal life. Hadaha, you came to the earth for me. I know this, my Lord. And I am so thankful, so appreciative of your love, your unconditional love for mankind. Blessed child in the world, Hadaha, I have so much I need to say unto my children on the earth. Will you scribe for me? Will you record my words? Will you release my words unto the nations? Yes, my Lord. We both come before you this day. Your willing vessels, your holy scribes. Your ambassadors. We burn with glory this day. We burn in love for you. Come, oh, my, my children, I am anointing you both this day. to come into my heavenly realm. Kanahan to record these words for the nations. There will be a thousand Pakasha journeys into heaven. A thousand journeys through my kingdom. Do not worry who is watching. These messages do not concern yourself. Kenamot simply release my messages, my words to the nations. And my words will go forth and not return void, and you will change the atmosphere. Hearts will change, minds will change. You will not even see what is happening with your physical eyes. But know that my words are going forth into the atmosphere. It doesn't matter who hears the words on this particular day. For my words are being released into the atmosphere. What you are doing is on a global scale, my children. For you are standing before me in spirit and in truth. And you are releasing the oil, the oil of your Lord, the oil of heaven, the oil of the Holy Spirit. 
my oil is pouring forth unto the nations at this time. You can, you can see the oil in spirit, the golden oil of your Lord. Allah the golden oil of heaven. The tangible oil of your God, pouring into the nations. Oh Lord, I feel full to overflowing with your glory right now. It is hard for me to even speak at this time. I have entered into a deep peace, a deep rest, complete contentment of soul. For I know I never have to leave your side again, my Lord, and I do not want to. I am tired of the worry and the fear and the struggles of this earth. And finally, I can rest with you. And I look forward to a thousand journeys with you. And my dear friend, as we record these words for the nation. Oh, together we come, we stand before you. In spirit and truth, we worship you night and day. And we thank you for divine order falling upon every area of our life. We thank you that we live in heaven on earth. We pray for a multitude of souls to be saved. Karahashikiti, through these words, my Lord. We thank you, Karahashiki, that heaven is being released. Visions of heaven. We pray that you guard our souls, our physical bodies, whilst we come and stand before you to release your oil. We worship you this day. We enter in and begin a lifetime of worship and praise and honour and glory for you, for your holy name. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, we worship you. I see the angel beside me begin to worship. His only focus is on loving you. His eyes are closed, and he is in deep worship. Nothing could distract him in this moment. I watch him. Alirekara, oh Lord, help us to be as your angels who worship you unconditionally, in spirit, in truth. Such holiness, such purity. There are no hidden motives, just love, thankfulness, gratitude for existence. Lord, I pray that you will give us a heart of worship as the angels have. That we will praise your holy name night and day, saying, Holy, holy, holy is the Lord God Almighty, who was and is and is to come. Glory, 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 holy, holy, holy. The Lord Jesus takes my hand and on the earth my hand burns with holy fire. Beautiful children, place your hand on your heart this day for I wish to anoint you. You too are my children, my messengers on the earth and I anoint you this day. You are my children, my ambassadors, and no man Allah can harm you, for I have surrounded you with a hedge of protection. My holy angels protect you both. For such a time as this, you have been born to release my message to the world. And I thank you. I praise you. I will bless and equip you. My spirit dwells within you both on the earth. It sustains you. 
pour out my spirit, pour out my oil. Come, Kashi Kitira Hala had here before me and record these words in heaven each day. I see the glory of heaven pouring upon the earth at this time like golden rain. The golden rain of heaven, I did not know what I see, falling upon people. And as it does, there is peace being released, love, joy. The eyes are being opened, spirits awakened, ears opened, to know the truth, to hear the gospel, to feel the glory. Spirits all across the earth are being awakened on this day to the reality of Jesus Christ, our Holy Father, the Blessed Holy Spirit. There is an awakening, Kari Nohorohashira, falling across the earth at this time. Even the hardest heart is being softened. The Hashikidakiri had those with the strongest arguments as to why Hashikihana they don't believe. Something is happening. There is a shift across the earth at this time. Amokora nanada the golden rain, Haleria nice falling. Oh, the golden glory. Mantarabashi did a lot of us, he canaha she did a hina hana 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 hana. People are feeling the glory right now. They don't know what it is, but it is beautiful. It is warming their heart and their soul at this time. And in all of Misakara, some people are sitting down because they feel so herhashi free, so much peace. The peace of God is being released amongst the nations so that every knee will bow and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. You want for all of your children to come home to you this day. You do not want a single soul to be lost to the darkness. He had to choose her to walk away, to walk along the wide path. We praise you, Lord. Kinahatara says something supernatural is happening on our earth at this time. I see the darkness, Allah here falling under the weight of the rain like dark puddles. And the darkness is being replaced by golden puddles. Allah Bhatara has going to wash the darkness away. The darkness that resides within the hearts of man, the sin. Through the blood of Jesus Christ and the forgiveness of sins, we can all walk into eternal life at Karahashikiti at life's end. I see golden puddles starting to form across the earth. I see your children begin to splash in the puddles like little children. There is a joy being released amongst the nations. Joy in the hearts of your children as they realize that eternal life is real. There is no death. It is just an illusion. Our spirit is eternal. Our spirit exists forever. Our spirit will one day be so free. Free to soar in paradise with our Lord. Free to dance. Blessed children in the world, come to me this day. Allah, your ears are being opened, your heart opened. I need you to respond to me this hour. If you have never given unto me your life, I ask that you give unto me your whole life this day. And you too can be filled with the golden glory, the love of heaven, the peace and joy of my heavenly realm. Your sins can be forgiven. 
you can be redeemed and sanctified, delivered and set free. All you need to do is come to me and be thankful. Confess your sins, repent of your wicked ways, promise to turn. I promise to come and lead and guide you, to transform you and renew your mind. I promise to forgive you through my blood that was shed for you in Calvary. And you will be set free. Your sins will be forgiven now and forevermore. Because you came. You said yes to this invitation. And you will walk with me in paradise at life's end. This I promise to you now. Amen.